All right, so let's talk about a great exercise for just helping to build what we call the posterior chain or your hamstrings, glutes, um, back extensors, uh, really you know, important muscles that are part of kind of our core set of muscles that help us to move and stabilize. And so really important. So it's a single leg bridge. So what we're gonna do here is you're gonna lay down on your back and a double leg bridge is with both feet here and you're gonna drive your hips up towards the ceiling, pushing down. The further your feet are towards your bum, the more you're gonna feel it in your quads, almost a stretch even. And then the further your feet are away from your body, the more you're gonna feel it in that posterior chain, so glutes, hamstrings. So that's with the double leg. Single leg is same idea. We're just gonna to move to one leg. So you're gonna put your leg uh, you know, parallel with your other thigh, and then you're gonna press up and hold, trying to keep your hips level so it's not dropping down. So if we switch, and do it on this side so you can see there. We're gonna press up and keep these hips level so it's not dropping, you're not rotating, you're keeping everything level. We're tightening core, we're tightening low back, squeezing glutes and hamstrings to be able to hold that position. And so um, you would do that several repetitions. So I showed kind of more of a hold with it, but you'd actually do repetitions of pressing that up and you can add weight. So as you get stronger, so coming up, you may start with just body weight where you're here, pressing up, it's a good pause at the top and then coming back down. Each repetition should take about four counts. So up, two, three, four, and down, and up, two, three, four, and down. And you can add weight then, you can hold like a, a dumbbell or a, a plate on your stomach, hold it there, or you can add ankle weights, things like that, to make that more challenging. The more your arms are across your chest instead of down here on the ground, the more difficult it's gonna be. It, it creates a little bit more of a challenge. So those are kind of the tips on how to do the exercise as well as how to progress it as you get stronger.